In the vast expanse of our natural world, we've always thought we understood the basic distinction between what's alive and what isn't. But nature, as it often does, has thrown us another fascinating curveball that's making scientists question everything they thought they knew about life itself. Imagine standing at the edge of a cliff, with one foot in the realm of the living and another in the world of non-living matter. That's exactly where this newly discovered entity exists, in a mind-bending gray area that challenges our fundamental understanding of life. For centuries, scientists have used specific criteria to determine if something is alive. It needs to grow, reproduce, respond to its environment, maintain homeostasis, and carry out metabolic processes. But this new discovery doesn't fit neatly into these categories. It's like finding a color that exists between black and white, something that shouldn't theoretically be possible. This mysterious entity, found in the depths of extreme environments, displays characteristics of both living organisms and non-living matter. It can replicate itself, but not in the way traditional life forms do. It responds to its environment, but through mechanisms we've never seen before. It's as if nature decided to write its own rule book, completely ignoring the boundaries we've carefully drawn. Think about it like this. If you were to create a spectrum of existence, with a rock on one end and a human being on the other, where would you place something that shows signs of life, but doesn't fully qualify as living? This discovery is forcing us to redraw that spectrum entirely. The implications of this finding are staggering. It could potentially revolutionize our understanding of how life began on Earth. Maybe the transition from non-living to living matter wasn't a sudden leap, but a gradual process with many in-between stages that we're only now beginning to understand. This discovery might also hold clues about potential life forms on other planets. If life can exist in this gray area on Earth, imagine the possibilities across the universe, where conditions are vastly different from what we consider life-friendly. As we stand on the brink of this revolutionary discovery, one thing becomes clear. The line between life and non-life is far more blurry than we ever imagined. And perhaps that's exactly what makes this finding so exciting. It reminds us that even in a world we think we know so well, there are still mysteries waiting to be unraveled. In the end, this discovery isn't just about finding a new entity. It's about expanding our perspective on what's possible in nature. It's a humbling reminder that the more we learn about our world, the more we realize how much we still don't understand.